Hello. So I got permission to post this video. Um, we got a package in the mail and it's from one of my followers and her name is Paulette. And so I wanna make sure I don't accidentally show your address, but um, she sent me an email saying that it's coming. So let's see, Terry. I tried a keto chow shake again and my tummy wasn't happy. I heard adding gelatin could help. I was so happy to see you using your keto chow and then you bought yours if, oh, bought yourself a Ninja Creamy. What a difference it makes in the finished product. You truly amaze me at how you, of how bold and brave you are being so upfront and brave in your journey. You have really embraced your frozen keto chow creamies. I love how your mind works so it can benefit you. We all learn from you. I have these last eight to 10 pounds to lose and find it difficult and find it difficult. Keep doing what you do, your keto chow friend, Paulette. So Paulette is the one that sent me the previous batch of keto chow and she sent me some more. So she said that, you know, she, she doesn't do it because she doesn't want recognition, but I did get permission to let you know. So Paulette, thank you so much. I'm going to, this is going to be low key because I promised her it'd be low key and not, not all wild. So this is, this is my version of keeping it low key, Paulette, my version. So uh, we're going to kind of take a peek at these and thank you, thank you, thank you so much, Paulette. Thank you. We got a chocolate peanut butter, mocha, blueberry, two chocolates. We have a chocolate malt. I think that's going to be so good. Orange mango, chai latte. Snickerdoodle, uh, orange mango, orange cream, pecan sticky bun, salted caramel, blueberry pie, vanilla. We got strawberry cream, strawberry cream, raspberry cheesecake, raspberry cheesecake, birthday cake, birthday cake, birthday cake, birthday cake, birthday cake, birthday cake. Birthday cake. So something that's really cool about the birthday cake is that um, you, when you mix other like things into it, it really makes it taste like a, a, a specialized cake. So like I put it, squirted in some of my, you know, one of my enhancers and it still keeps that cake flavor. So it, like, are you strawberry? It's almost like a strawberry watermelon. It's almost like a strawberry watermelon cake. So it's really cool. We got, oh, vanilla cream. I wonder how that's different. Vanilla. Vanilla cream. We've got two butterscotch. You no, know that's I love that. Ooh, cookies and cream, pecan sticky bun, pumpkin spice, pumpkin spice. Oh, hold up. Pumpkin spice caramel. Oh, snap. That's gonna be amazing. And two salted caramels. Paulette, thank you so much. I'm gonna put you up on my board by the other one that you sent me. I just gotta find it. So Give me just a second to find it, Miss Paulette. Oh, there it is. There it is. I see it up there. So I'm going to get you added. Hang on just a second. All right. All right. I know you want to keep it low key because this isn't a, you know, you don't want a bunch of, but anyway, you're up there. So that's where you're at on my third, on my third door. Thank you so much, Paulette, for supporting my new addiction. <laughs> I am so excited because um, I have four containers I just washed last night. So I'm going to make up some more tonight for tomorrow. I kind of want to try it without the milk. I'm very curious how that will work. You know, I've done it with the milk and um, I don't think I've made it with, I might have made it. I don't remember if I've made it without, but I kind of just want to see what happens. So, you know me, I like to experiment, but thank you so much, Paulette. I truly appreciate you. Thank you so much.